Robinhood, the trading app beloved by millions, recently hit a snag. This app, which has revolutionized the way people trade stocks, especially among younger generations, faced an unexpected challenge. Their third quarter earnings fell short of expectations. This surprised many investors who had high hopes for the company's performance. Robinhood is known for its easy-to-use platform and focus on attracting younger investors. So what happened? The app's simplicity and appeal to novice traders have been its strengths, but recent financial results tell a different story. The company reported lower than expected revenue. This shortfall has raised eyebrows across the financial community. This means they didn't make as much money as Wall Street predicted. This miss is important because it reflects deeper issues within the company. It raises questions about Robinhood's future growth and profitability. Investors are now wondering if the company can sustain its rapid growth. The stock market reacted immediately. The news sent shockwaves through the trading community. Shares of Robinhood tumbled after the announcement, signaling investor concern. The drop in stock price indicates a loss of confidence among shareholders. It's crucial to understand why this happened and what it means for Robinhood moving forward. The company's future strategy will be under intense scrutiny. Over the next few sections, we'll delve into the factors that contributed to this earnings miss. We'll explore the challenges Robinhood faces and what it needs to do to regain investor trust. One area of focus has been Robinhood's customer promotion program. To attract new users, Robinhood offered incentives like free stock. This strategy is designed to entice potential investors to sign up and start trading on their platform. These promotions can be costly. The company has to account for the expense of giving away free stock, which can add up quickly. They can eat into a company's profits, especially if they fail to attract long-term customers. If the new users don't stay and trade regularly, the initial investment in these promotions may not pay off. How can promotions affect a company's revenue? This is a critical question for any business considering such strategies. Promotions can boost revenue in the short term. They create a surge of new users and trading activity, which can be beneficial initially. They attract new customers and generate excitement. This buzz can lead to increased visibility and more signups. However, if these customers don't stick around or trade frequently, the long-term impact on revenue can be minimal. The initial excitement may fade and the users may become inactive. The cost of acquiring each customer through promotions might outweigh the revenue they generate. This is a delicate balance that needs careful consideration. Robinhood's challenge is to find the right balance. They need to weigh the costs of these promotions against the potential long-term benefits. They need to attract new users while ensuring these users become profitable customers. This involves not just getting them to sign up, but also keeping them engaged and active on the platform. This means converting those who joined for the promotion into active traders who generate revenue for the platform. It's a complex task that requires strategic planning and execution. Net income is the profit a company makes after all its expenses have been deducted. It is essentially the bottom line of a company's income statement. This figure is crucial because it shows the actual profitability of the company. It's a key indicator of a company's financial health and overall performance. Investors and analysts closely monitor net income to gauge how well a company is doing. For instance, Robinhood missed its net income forecast for the third quarter, which was a significant event. This means their profits were lower than expected, causing concern among investors. What are the consequences of missing net income forecasts? Missing these forecasts can have several negative impacts. Missing net income forecasts can damage investor confidence significantly. Investors may start to doubt the company's ability to generate profits. It suggests the company might not be as profitable as anticipated, raising red flags about its future prospects. This can lead to a decline in stock price, which can be detrimental to the company's market value. A declining stock price makes it harder for the company to raise capital in the future as investors become wary. Robinhood needs to address its profitability challenges to regain investor trust and stabilize its financial standing they must find ways to increase revenue and manage expenses effectively. 
This could involve exploring new revenue streams, cutting unnecessary costs, or improving operational efficiency. Section 5, Robinhood's Road Ahead. Challenges and Opportunities. Robinhood's third quarter earnings miss is a significant event. It raises questions about the company's future. They face challenges in a competitive fintech landscape. However, they also have opportunities to innovate and grow. Robinhood needs to refine its strategy. They need to balance attracting new users with generating sustainable profits. They also need to navigate regulatory scrutiny and adapt to changing customer behavior. The road ahead won't be easy, but Robinhood has the potential to overcome these challenges and emerge stronger. Their success will depend on their ability to adapt and innovate in a rapidly evolving market. Section 6. Customer Behavior – A Shifting Landscape One challenge for Robinhood is understanding evolving customer behavior. The pandemic led to a surge in retail investing. People had more time and in some cases more disposable income. However, this trend might be slowing down. People are returning to pre-pandemic routines. They might have less time for trading. Economic uncertainty could also make people more cautious with their investments. Robinhood needs to understand how these shifts impact their user base. They need to adapt their platform and offerings to meet the changing needs of their customers. Section 7. Competition in the FinTech Arena. Who's winning the race? The fintech industry is incredibly competitive. New players are constantly emerging. This puts pressure on established companies like Robinhood to innovate and differentiate themselves. Traditional brokerage firms are also enhancing their digital offerings. They are trying to attract younger, tech-savvy investors. This competition could impact Robinhood's market share. Robinhood needs to stay ahead of the curve. They need to offer unique features and a seamless user experience to remain competitive. Section 8. Regulatory Headwinds. Navigating the Storm. Increased regulatory scrutiny is another challenge for Robinhood. Lawmakers and regulators are paying more attention to the fintech industry. They are concerned about investor protection and market stability. New regulations could impact Robinhood's business model. They might have to adjust their offerings or face increased compliance costs. Robinhood needs to proactively engage with regulators. They need to demonstrate their commitment to responsible innovation and investor protection. Section 9. Innovation Imperative. Can Robinhood stay ahead of the curve? Despite these challenges, Robinhood has opportunities for growth. They need to continue innovating and expanding their offerings. This could include new investment products, offering a wider range of investment options beyond stocks and cryptocurrencies personalized financial tools, providing users with tools and resources to make informed investment decisions, expansion into new markets, exploring opportunities to expand internationally and reach new customer segments. By embracing innovation, Robinhood can differentiate itself from competitors and attract new users. Section 10, long-term vision building a sustainable business. Robinhood's long-term success depends on their ability to build a sustainable business. This means diversifying revenue streams, reducing reliance on transaction fees and exploring new revenue models, controlling expenses, managing costs effectively to improve profitability, building trust with users, prioritizing transparency and responsible innovation to earn and maintain user trust. By focusing on these key areas, Robinhood can create a more resilient and profitable business for the long term. Section 11. What's next for Robinhood? Robinhood's journey is far from over. They face challenges and opportunities. Their response to this earnings miss will be closely watched by investors and the industry as a whole. What do you think? Share your thoughts and questions in the comments below. This is a critical moment for Robinhood. Their decisions now will shape their future. It will be interesting to see how they navigate the road ahead.